for my Nigerian people, you know when you write jump, there's a place you have to go, you sit with the computer and everything, that's just how it is. And it's Hi guys, I'm back again. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Adelike. In today's episode, I'm telling you five things you should know about UK theory test. The number one you should do is download this app. This one. I don't know if you can see it very well. This one here, I'll give you the screenshot. And this one. The app is called Theory 4 in 1. And the second one is called Theory Test. It's not for free. I think you're going to pay like two two pounds or three pounds it's not up to five pounds but you have to pay to be able to download the app once you download the app then you can start practicing the second thing you should know about the uk theory test is before you can register for uk theory test you need to have a provisional driver's license which is this this is my provisional driver's license here yeah. This is the provisional driver's license. You need to apply for the provisional driver's license. And once you get your provisional driver's license, then you can apply for, you can book your theory test. And the third thing you should know about UK theory test is prepare yourself mentally for it. I keep telling people it is not easy. It looks so easy because it's multiple question and it comes in two parts, multiple question and hazard. The multiple question is they'll give you 50 questions to answer why for the hazard pass they'll give you 14 questions to answer you're going to watch videos and you click 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 if you see upcoming hazard like maybe um be this trans or a dog trying to cross the road you just need to cite it first so you click 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 the more the, if you click the click in the accurate time you're going to get more score so yeah another thing you should know about the uk theory test is you have to go to a center to do it they have a center for my Nigerian people you know when you write jump there's a place you have to go you sit with the computer and everything that's just how it is and the theory the test is so fast when i went for my i didn't spend up to 30 minutes yeah i didn't spend up to 30 minutes and i finished on time and another important thing you know about the theory test is you have to be careful to really really be careful about the theory test because there's been a lot of rumor of people paying someone to write your theory test for you. Guys, it doesn't work that way. If you pay someone to write your theory test for you, you get caught. <laughs> the UK government here, they will send you to... They don't joke with any criminal activities here. Any fraudulent activities, they don't joke. So, get your mindset right. Download this app. Practice, guys. Practice, keep practicing every day. So you know you are ready when you're very sure that yes i'm ready to take this test then book it up then book the test if you know you're not sure don't be worried because you'll fail it's just as simple as that and the fifth one is go with positive mindsets yes go with positive mindset right here um, and i wish you luck if you have a problem or looking for ways for me to help you prepare for your theory test just comment below i'm here for you guys i'm always here to make everything easy you know what we do on this channel i talk about a lot of things not just about travel now that i'm currently in the uk i'm going to be giving you information about the uk or how to settle in the uk let me tell you transportation in the uk is so easy that people tend to forget that they need to learn how to drive but the best way to move in the uk is for you to drive it's like the fastest way because using the bus is fast i'm not saying it's not fast but there are some places you want to go to and the, when you go to the bus station you see that you have to wait for like 10 15 minutes which slows things down so it's actually advisable for you to get your driver's license or get your theory test on and settle in properly get a car so that your movement can be smooth and moreover there are some jobs that request you to have a driver's license some jobs want you to have a driver's license. This is more reason why you should prepare yourself and get past your theory test and go for your practical test. Yeah, these are all the basic things you need to know about UK theory test. And the, to register for the UK theory test, it costs £24. Yeah, I think £24, £23, yes. It costs £24 to register for this. I'm going to put the link below. If you have any questions, don't forget to ask me. I still need to write there. I'll see you on the next episode of Momentum UK. Stay safe, you bye.